The four dissenting IEBC commissioners who sought invalidation of the presidential election results have jointly welcomed the Supreme Court's decision upholding President-elect William Ruto's win on Monday. In a statement, the four commissioners say they are fully back to work and have endorsed the statement issued by IEBC Chairperson Wafula Chebukati on Monday. Stephen Leto now reports. The four commissioners issued a joint statement Tuesday morning saying, quote, after the Supreme Court met the ruling yesterday on the presidential election petition with regard to the role of the commissioners, wish to convey our appreciation to the honorable judges of the Supreme Court of Kenya and confirm that we respect their collective decisions. On Monday, Chebukati said it was up to the four commissioners, Vice Chairperson Juliana Cherera, Justice Nyangaya, Francis Wanderi, and Irene Masit to decide the way forward. It's, it's up to them and they are conscious what they want to do going forward. But as, as a commission, we follow the law and we have not just away anyone. The four commissioners endorsed Chebukati's Monday press statement saying, quote, We also state here that we agree with the statement of the chairperson of the commission which was sent to the media yesterday we wish to reiterate that we stand by the rule of law and statutes that promote effectiveness of the work of the commission the four indicating they were fully back at work to execute their roles as they await the detailed supreme court verdict the supreme court in its verdict trained its guns on the ibc of what it termed as boardroom wrangles all this in our view points to a serious malaise in the governance of an institution entrusted with one of the monumental tasks of midwifing our democracy. Despite supporting prayers for invalidation of the election, the Supreme Court found that the four commissioners participated in telling and verification of results and upheld the results, brushing aside claims by the dissenters that there was opacity at the final stage prior to the announcement. The Supreme Court also termed logs produced in an affidavit by Commissioner Justice Nyangaya as being of no probative value. The chairperson of of the commission say that the Supreme Court's decision vindicated IEBC. Stephen Leto, Citizen TV.